unhinge my knuckles from the handlebars. <laughs> 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 Yeah. Camp, how's the recon treating so far? Bumpy. Bumpy. <laughs> yeah, I, first couple of sectors I had to sort of unhinge my knuckles from the handlebars, but um, getting used to it. Looking forward to Sunday, that's for sure. The good thing about Sunday is we'll get over them a lot quicker because we'll be going a lot faster, so I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> So last year, yeah. you said, I'm never going to ride Pyro Bay again, or something along the lines. Thanks for reminding me, man. I still have, you know, two days to change my mind. So, uh, guys, we have 30 riders in the team. Be ready, you know, for the phone call from the DSs, maybe. Yeah, I mean, we just we just want to go with the momentum, you know, use that uh, good morale of uh, previous wins and uh, use that spirit to to win that monument on Sunday. A good big, just admire Big Ben sock height. I don't think it's UCI legal. But they run new shoes. They deserve high socks. All you guys go through the gears, eh? All yeah. these new cassettes. Yeah. It's um, yeah, uh, 11.30. Is there going to be any scones at the coffee so stop? this race would have been okay. Scones or scones? I say scones. <laughs> scones. <laughs> I got a joke. What's the fastest oh, cake in the world? Scone. Scone. <laughs> 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 This is for the dragon. You got change? Oh, you have half. Next week. Okay, I'll take the dragon. You put this here, and then when someone comes, you can sell it. We've got, obviously, there's a, a lot of the, the young riders now in the team. What would you say they're, they're bringing to the team? Definitely that enthusiasm and that, uh, you know, we got Big Ben, Little Ben, Kimbo, Magnus, you know, the list goes on. And just to have that uh, kind of new lease of life a bit, really, um, brings a bit of a buzz to the team. I've really enjoyed it. How do you win Paris Bay? What does it take to win Paris Bay? You've, you've done it before, back yeah. in 2001? 2001, yes, yeah. yes, a long time ago. Yeah, how do you win it? First of all, you need to have good legs. Uh, a strong team will help. Um, I think if, if when you have good legs and you have in top shape, you also uh, avoid crashes a little bit easier, I think. And you're really spot on, then you see every hole, your reaction is in time with everything. We have a young group of riders, super motivated, uh, and, and a group that really wants to learn. They study the courses, uh, and besides that, they are very strong bike riders, big talents. Yeah, pretty excited, to be honest. The way we're racing, it's pretty cool. So um, that's what we need tomorrow as well. And yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. Riders rolled out along the 257.2 kilometer course between Compiègne and Roubaix. Each and every one of the seven riders from the Ineos Grenadiers made it into the front group. And a gap as big as just under a minute and a half opened up as they hit the first cobbles at Troisville. The mechanical problem started. Filippo Ganna, one of the first to suffer. Filippo Ganna, à l'euro dans le premier groupe. Dilla van Bala in the lead of Paris Roubaix with 18 and a half kilometers to go. One minute, BK, come on. Eh? One minute, 10. Come on. Come on, Dylan. Come on, Dylan. Come on, Dylan. One minute, mate. Come on, eh? One minute. You're amazing, Dylan. Legend. 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 Nice. Now, left, right on the cobbles. That cobbles will have your name also eh, next year. Come on, Dylan. He shakes his head. He doesn't believe it, but he better had. Around turn four. Into the home straight. And Dylan from Barna can see the finish line. Solo, on his own, the job done. Dylan from Barna, it's all yours. <laughs> to 
be second in Flanders and winning Roubaix. Yeah, I, I'm lost for words.